Hello again, it's Dr. Dave, and today I want to talk about some issues regarding weight. As you may be aware, the rates of obesity in the United States have climbed dramatically in the past couple of decades. And in fact, not only do we have more obese people today than we ever have, the United States has a rate of obesity that is above almost every other nation in the world. Now, there's a lot of ways to define obesity, but many of the experts define it this way. It means you weigh at least 20% above the recommended weight based on your sex, male or female, and your body frame size, in particular your height. So if your healthy weight, let's say it's considered to be 180 to 200 pounds, if you weigh in that zone, you're considered to be of a healthy weight, below that is underweight, and above that would be overweight. But if you go more than 20% above that healthy limit, so 20% of 200, well, that'd be 240 pounds. At that point, you would be considered obese. And the current uh, data is that about a third of all Americans are either at a healthy weight or they're underweight. About a third of all Americans are overweight, but not to the point of obesity. And about a third are considered obese. Um, obesity has a number of factors which contribute to it. Uh, obviously, part has to do with the foods that we choose to eat. Vegetables, for example, and lean meats are probably going to be better choices for you than fatty foods and um, fat and uh, meats that are higher in fat, like ground beef. Uh, a lot of it has to do with our portion sizes, which have gotten increasingly bigger throughout the years. We eat a lot more than we really need to. And finally, we're a very sedentary society. We don't move around as much as we ought to be. We need to be more physically active as people in previous generations were. We also have a couple of concerns with eating disorders, anorexia, which basically involves starving yourself by choice. And there's also bulimia nervosa, which involves taking in a large amount of calories in a short amount of time and then getting rid of those calories, usually by throwing up sometimes by fasting or exercising or taking laxatives or diuretics. Hope this helped.